welcome to Radha Susila Holistics. Today we will see how the emotional energies are for scorpions. Uh, we will for the emotional energy play a very important role in our life. Emotions should always be maintained. You should not give way to depression, think overthinking and let things overtake you. It's not good for you. It will cause mood stings, uh, mood swings and health problems. That is the reason for all kind of health problems in our life. So emotion you should maintain, do meditation or listen to some good music wherein your emotions can be controlled. Go for heart chakra balancing that will help you a lot. Now we will see what message the universe wants to send you this week for you. You have got listen. Never think that you should only tell, you should be the speaker and the other party should be the listener. It is not going to help in any relation. You or your partner thinks that way. So you or your partner should change and you should listen. Not only listening to one another, listening to yourself is also very important. What your inner heart says about the situation, what your inner gut feelings say about your uh, um, relationship, that also you have to listen. Quiet your mind, beloved one, and listen to our gentle reassurance that everything has been taken care of everything every aspect of you is taken care by the angels you need not worry for anything each and small small aspects also it is taken care so you go within yourself meditate meditate yourself so that you can in the quietitude you can start listening to your own internal voice which is talking to you stay in a quiet and receptive state without worrying about the exact nature of your desires manifestation don't think that it should happen this way it should happen that way that is not the way of thinking you should be very uh, very flexible in your desires manifestation of the desires first you give a thought listen be all the uh, what all thoughts you get what all thinking you get what all negative vibrations you get in your mind you one by one one by one one by one try to remove it and stay focused on yourself and listen what your inner heart says in that quietitude in that silence in that receptive uh, receptive mood your inner voice will talk with you your inner voice will guide you that is the guidance of the universe that is the guidance of the angels a quiet mind and body hears as quickly and clearly this is our request to you listen so when you are more quiet you don't allow all negative thoughts and bad thoughts and fears to overtake you you can go within yourself in a meditative state you can or in your dream state you can know the answers for your question directions how you should do so start listening more rather than fear about the future and fear about your relation try to listen from within that plays a very important role and uh, to put light on it what more the universe is going to tell us about this relation we will uh, take another card i'm going to take a card from the ascension card we will take a card today you have got high praised exercise your leadership qualities this time uh, this is a time for strong and selfless service this time is very good for you wherein you don't think i i i that aspect you leave it off and think in general think about you and think about your partner's position both of that you think then you will get a very good solution for the problem the thinking of i i i will more and more 
bring a split in the relationship rather than getting you together that is very important aspect which you should remember now we will go and see what are the energies in the past what are the energies now and how the energies are going to be in future on your emotional front on your love front on your romantic front in the past you have got the card a nine of cups it says that you are holding you feel that i i need it i want it i it should be like this it should go this way it should go as i expect it should not be the other way you or your person is overly obsessed or overly possessed about one another and you feel and you dictate the way how it should be this way it should be that is not proper that's why we have got and you feel comfortable you always want to be in the comfort zone you never want to come out of it that's what we have seen in this high priest card it says that no this is not the way you shouldn't behave like this you should be more flexible you should be more no thinking i i i i is not going to serve the purpose and now we will see how is the present energies of your romantic life you have got eight of uh, cups when a small thing goes different from the aspect you think or you have to take a small step out of the comfort zone you or your partner feel that no we will leave off the relation for every small thing you feel that no this relation is not going to work i will quit the relation i am going to come out of the relation i can't quit my comfort zone this is not going to be that you for you feel very much uh, you hold it you think that you are very much uh, obsessive that it should happen only the way otherwise i am going to quit the relationship this relationship is no longer going to serve me such kind of uh, thoughts you get in your mind but it is not like that you should be more flexible you should be more uh, what more flexible so that the you or you or your person should be more flexible so that the relation goes fine and hermit card also adds and says the same thing you whenever a small thing happens and you have to come out of the comfort zone you feel that you should isolate yourself from them this relation is not going to work for me i should leave the relation or your person is thinking like that this is not the way that's how you feel in the present that this is not going to happen i can't stay any more and knight of pentacles say that you are comparing your person with some other who is more uh, more uh, speed in nature who is more talkative who is more uh, um how about this more uh, bubbly in nature whom you who with whom you get attracted but it is not the thing like that every when you see from outside everything will be good everything will be nice when you go inside then every the complete scenario will change you are in a position of thinking in the present like that what the future holds for you knight of cups you will be more attracted to the new person you have got in your life and you will think of leaving this relationship and you may switch off to the other the other person you or your person may think of changing the relation quitting you one yourself and going for a altogether a new relation whom they think that their vibes go well or your vibes go well with them the person your person right now is not according to your vibes they are more obsessed uh, by themselves and this new relation will definitely bring joy and happiness in your life you will be in a very joyful mood you will feel very happy the present situation what you think is not working anymore for you the new relation which you have got or the new relation somebody coming from your past will bring lot of happiness in your life and there will be 
happiness and enjoyment in your life which all these days because of your fear and because of your nature or your person's nature you were not able to accomplish all your dreams can be accomplished now and they definitely will be celebrations in your life so listen to your heart listen what it says and take the correct decision because you are very uh, very strong person you can change your situations you can generate a lot of positive vibration no longer cling to the relation which is not serving you and which makes you feel depressed and feel and makes you feel that you are a underdog such kind of relation is not going to help you in any way now we will see what the universe is going to give as a concluding message this week so that you can think about it in peace i live and move and experience life because i keep myself contented in inner peace i have peace in my outer world whatever we got in this lesson this card that you should go inside introspect yourself do meditation and find out what your inner feeling says what your inner heart says how you should be the same thing you have got from the uh, message of conclusion message from the universe i am at the center of peace because you listen to your intuitions you listen to what comes from your at you are in a better position you take decisions according to your inner feelings and not because of the society or because of what others think you give importance to your inner god so you have peace in yourself and that peace prevails all around you and it prevails in outside you also if you like our video kindly like it share it and subscribe it 